Hi everyone, Anthony Morganti here. As you probably know, I've been teaching Lightroom for some time and I've been using Lightroom a lot longer. One would think that I would know everything there is to know about Lightroom. Well, that isn't true because today I learned something about Lightroom that I did not know. As a matter of fact, I thought this was a bug in Lightroom and it turns out it's a feature of Lightroom. In today's video, I want to share with you what that is and to ask you, is there anything about Lightroom that you've learned recently? Any obscure thing that you think might help others? Let us know in the comment section. Now, as you can see, I have Lightroom open and you probably can't tell, but I'm in the library module and you probably can't tell because I have all the panels closed. And by default, if you have a panel or all the panels closed in Lightroom and you want to temporarily open one up, all you need to go do is take your cursor and move it over towards that panel and it will pop open as I did the left panel and the top panel and the right panel and the film strip. If you want to permanently keep that panel open, all you need to do is click on that little triangle and it will permanently open up the panel. And you can see that this behavior is operating the way it should in the library module of Lightroom on my iMac. If I go over to the develop module um, and I close down all the panels, you'll notice that that behavior will work similarly here, except on the left panel. When I go over to the left panel and hover, the left panel is at opening, but it does on the top panel, the right panel, in the film strip. Why doesn't it temporarily open on the left panel? Well, I thought this was a bug. So I submitted this as a bug report to Adobe. And they got back to me and said, yeah, we're working on that. We'll let you know. And it took like six weeks. Then they let me know, hey, no, that's not a bug. That's a feature. If you want this panel on the left-hand side to automatically open when you hover over there, you need to double-click on that little triangle. When you double click on that little triangle, that behavior will return. As you can see, it is now. If you want it to be back the way I had it, go back over to that little triangle and double click on it. Now, that panel will not auto open when you hover over there. So, somewhere along the line, I must have inadvertently double clicked on this little triangle on the left hand panel and I made it so the left-hand panel doesn't auto-open. I thought that was a bug, not a feature. And I embarrassingly submitted that as a bug to Adobe. Um, but they actually thought it was too, because they said, okay, uh, thank you, we'll let you know. And then it took them six weeks around, around six weeks, to let me know that that isn't a bug. That is an actual feature. So that's it for this video. Just I wanted to share that with you. Maybe you've run into the same thing and thought it was a bug as well. Well, just double click on that little triangle and you'll bring this default behavior back. Again, if there's anything about Lightroom, something obscure maybe that is an actual feature that you didn't know existed until recently, let us know in the comments. Thank you everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. Talk to you guys soon.